Early in the morning of September 22, 1780, Major John Andre, the British spy, quietly rowed ashore in Havistraw on the Hudson River. He came from a British ship, the Vulture, located just off of Croton Point, and he landed right in this spot. He climbed up into these woods along the shore to meet with an American general, Benedict Arnold. The greatest spy scandal of the American Revolution was about to begin right in our own neighborhood. After four years of war, American General Benedict Arnold was frustrated and felt the Americans were sure to lose. He decided to give up the fort that he commanded, West Point, and join the British. If he had succeeded, the British might have gained control of the Hudson and might have won the war. Arnold and Andre talked in these woods in this spot, and then quietly went to a house in Havistra, located here, where they finished plotting. Now Andre had to get back to his ship, the Vulture, with the plans. But there was a problem. The Americans had started firing on the Vulture from this cannon on Croton Point. The cannon forced the Vulture down the river towards New York. From the house on the hill in Havistra, Andre could probably see and hear the shooting in the distance. What a scary sight that must have been. Andre was now stuck behind enemy lines. Andre used false identification papers from Arnold and got across the Hudson to Westchester, but had to travel on foot along the river towards the safety of the British lines near New York City. Major Andre got to this spot in Terrytown, where he was captured by some American soldiers. At some point, they searched Major Andre. No one knows why. Perhaps they grew suspicious. Perhaps they were trying to rob him. What we do know is that hidden in Andre's sock, they found the plans to West Point. The plot was foiled. Major Andre was captured. Andre was imprisoned here and was executed by the Americans, while Arnold escaped to the English unharmed. <laughs>